morning guys so today kukuha tayo ng pichay ay pichay eh, spinach para lulutuin natin so we will harvest some of the spinach for breakfast so this is my spinach plant so they look uh, getting more more leaves so we need to take some of it so that they can get more later on so it's good for them as well to, to remove some so that they can get more later on the next day so it's good to take some of your spinach so this is a Norwegian spinach kind of Norwegian spinach. They are very crispy. Very crispy spinach. See? You just cut it. Very good. Beautiful. So I use the spinach to put together egg and cook a little in a pan and put salt and pepper and that's it it's breakfast so that's how I eat my spinach so I do this every morning eating spinach in the morning with egg egg from our hands so later we will get some eggs from our chickens so we can have fresh as well it's good to have fresh eggs fresh spinach fresh eggs so very nice in order for your spinach to get more uh, leaves or spinach leaves then you must take some of the bigger one that already matured and then you will wait after a week I think a week or I don't know how faster the growing process of the leaves of the spinach the new coming out so as you can see this one this one I will show you this one it's coming new this is the new coming it's inside there so after we take the the bigger then it will come new one again and this one I will take this bigger this one and then there's coming new new there and this one we need to take it and then it will come new again this one it's new new so it's continue producing a new leaves of spinach so it's very good right so we will get the eggs now so we get three eggs this morning and some will get it later because it's too early it's eight o'clock so we have food now eggs and peanuts together we will cook for breakfast so it's very good to have a farm to have chickens to have garden you can have free for your breakfast this morning so let us cook and prepare our breakfast Ayan na yung tatlong egg. Ayan na yung eggs natin guys. Uh, we will cook together with our spinach for breakfast. So I add uh, salt and pepper. Just mix together.
So I used to spin this uh, spinach to dry it to remove some of the extra water before I used to pack them if I have so much spinach extra. So that it helps for the leaves to not damage faster. So you need to have this kind of tools that can dry like that, can remove all the extra water. As you can see, it's a little dry now, so not so very wet because the extra water we take it. But if you want to be more dry, then you do it many times. <laughs> so first we have, uh, I heat a little of oil or oil, yeah, or oil. And then, So just heat the uh, oil and pour the eggs. After that, before the egg cook, then you can put your spinach. So that the spinach will go together. And then just mix a little. Just mix the little, mix a little bit the spinach and the egg so that it tastes a little good for the spinach to have a little taste in the egg. Just like that. It is a very slow fire. So that it will not be overcooked or too much. Luto natin spinach with egg. So this is our finished product for spinach with egg for breakfast. And as you can see, this is how I eat it. I put on the top of the bread together with the drinks or chocolate drinks or coffee so it's a very good thing to have a garden and uh, chickens or little chickens in our yard so you can have your own free food for breakfast very Maybe some other people think that it's a very small thing. You can you can afford to buy spinach and eggs, but it's a very good feeling when you grow something from your yard. You grow food for yourself, then it's a very good feeling to eat it. What you labor. Okay, so let us eat. So we get additional four eggs for today. After we got uh, three eggs this morning. So after two hours, I give them uh, food. And now when I check at the back inside the house, and I get four eggs. So we need to wash it and clean it because it's a little bit dirty, but it's okay. It's normal for the chicken's egg. So now we will go to our plants in our greenhouse. We will do something there. We will transplant.